Hi, I'm Joff. I own Bird and Carter Farm Shop with my wife Annie. Uh, we've been here for seven years and uh, got a cafe, a cafe Adelia and outside catering business. Uh, so we're situated just outside of Wilton on the A36, heading towards Warminster. Uh, originally started in Salisbury with a delicatessen, uh, and came across this place and uh, grew it from a from a little acorn into a, a modest uh, oak tree at the moment. Uh, so we do lots of home cooking from quiches, salads, soups, uh, savoury scones, uh, all the way up to sort of wedding meals and uh, private dining and shoot lunches. I've got two gilets, I've got the Babington, which is my day-to-day, -day, almost what I would define as my utility gilet, uh, which is rugged tweed. My other gilet is the smoking gilet, which is a lovely uh, purpley blue velvet with a pink collar and a lovely sort of sky blue lining, which looks fantastic as evening wear. They look very nicely finished, good stitching. The linings, they're pretty nice. Um, and, uh, and I think what I really quite like is the tailoring of them. They seem to fit very, very nicely. I can stash loads of stuff in it. Wallets, phones, etc., etc. And uh, also what I have discovered is that when I go offshore sailing, it works as a fantastic mid-layer. Uh, so recently I just uh, headed from Ibiza uh, up to Lisbon, where we stopped over for a couple of weeks, came back, did a bit more work, and then we did Lisbon to uh, Plymouth, via Akaruna, uh, where we sort of had to hit port for a couple of nights for a bit of tapas, maybe a few beers, but mainly to let a couple of gales go past. Then we found the perfect opportunity to race across Biscay and, uh, and get into Plymouth. So it keeps me very, very warm at night. Uh, if it gets wet, it dries within a few hours. Um, and. Uh, just a nice little collar, just enough to keep you snugly warm as the wind's whipping through the, through the shrouds. But there's no sleeves, so, so again, going back to the sort of sailing mid-layer, it gives you the freedom to move around. Um, you know, you can actually stretch and stuff like that without, without sort of tearing at seams or anything like that. So it's just a very, very liberating top to wear. I get into work about eight o'clock, uh, get into the kitchen, we start doing some cooking, then customers start rocking in at about 8.30, and then you're sort of multitasking between serving customers in the kitchen, cooking, and, uh, and basically troubleshooting throughout the day. So with my, with my gilet, what I find brilliant is uh, that you can either dress it up or you can dress it down. So you can just put on a nice shirt underneath, go out for an evening, or even a t-shirt, just rock up to the pub for a quick beer, or, uh, you know, if you're going into work, you can have your work clothes underneath. Again, you've got everything you need in your gilet and uh, hang it on the hook. If I'm in my chef's blacks, take off my gilet into the kitchen, start cooking, need to go out, gilet on, got everything in there, go to the hardware shop, get what you need, back you go.